this out. That's trending with JJ. More charges against former President Trump. Yesterday in a 45-page indictment, a federal grand jury charged him with four felony counts related to his efforts to remain in power following the 2020 election, with investigators from special counsel Jack Smith's office alleging a sprawling campaign by Trump and six unnamed co-conspirators to overturn President Biden's victory at the polls. Bye-bye incandescent bulbs. A Department of Energy rule requiring new light bulbs to have a minimum brightness of 45 lumens went into effect yesterday, effectively banning incandescent light bulbs, which are cheaper up front but more costly than LEDs in the long run since they burn out 30 times faster and need to be replaced more frequently. Super Bowl is getting the slime treatment for the first time ever. Next year, Super Bowl 58 in Vegas will be simulcast on Nickelodeon. All this means now is more and more people will argue that we need to make the day after the Super Bowl a national holiday. No, no we don't. AI chatbots with different multiple personas are coming to Meta, a.k.a. Facebook, Insta, WhatsApp, and Messenger, as early as September. These bots would engage with you, offer you recommendations, and more. Multiple personality bots talking with people online with multiple personalities. What could possibly go wrong? And the board are turning to Borax, the newest social media challenge that started on TikTok and has spread to Meta, has young and old alike touting the benefits of drinking Borax, saying it helps with everything from arthritis to the fight against cancer. Well, sure, because if you drink enough of it, you'll be dead. And dead pretty much cures everything. And that's trending.